Now all I gotta do is stir it up a little bit. And then we'll bring the water to the boil. And I will let you know I'm good at repurposing kitchen gadgets to use for other ways of cooking. Like for example, I am going to be cooking my um, poached eggs in, can you see it, a soup ladle. That way they will hold its shape. I'll be back once the water is boiling. Now I will crack the egg into the soup ladle. Yeah, you never thought about holding an egg to poach. Yeah, it looks good for that. Now all I'm doing is waiting for the water to boil. Now since the water is boiling, you want to drop it down to a simmer. And then you're going to take the ladle. A real low simmer. Wait till it gets down that low simmer. Then what we'll do is we'll slowly put this in. And yes, I'll be timing it four minutes and a half. Just gently putting it in. I sprayed the ladle with Pam so it won't stick. So now I'll gently lower it. That way it's contained. And we time it for four minutes since I was in about 30 seconds already I'll be back when it's done it's still cooking what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab a knife and lift it up a little bit to just gently loosen it to make sure that it's loosened so it don't stick it shouldn't stick it's perfectly loose because you can see it's almost floating and I'll be back when it's done now it's time for me to take it out of here see that it's floating I drain off some of the water and you can see I'm draining some water off That's what a poached egg looks like. I'll get another angle for you to see. That's what my poached egg looks like. So, that's all you gotta do for making the poached eggs.